Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another tier list video. If you hear some dogs in the background, I'm not going to apologize because they're my dogs and they're really cute. Here's a picture of one of my dogs. Love her a lot. Okay, um, I'm Anthony. Welcome back to Digigoons. Yippee! Woohoo! Hooray! Yeah, I don't know how to start these things. Um, they're super unscripted. We're going to be looking at every single Greymon variant today as we voted on on our poll. Um, maybe next week we'll get the Demon Slayer video. Um, but for this week we're going to be ranking every single Greymon. Let's get to that intro. All right, now that we're back, we're going to go ahead and start this thing. There's a fuck ton of Greymons. Some of these look the exact same, and that's going to be a problem when we rank them. But we're going to figure it out, because I don't know the difference between these guys. Uh, but first up, we have, uh, all the way on the left side here, we have Rampage Greymon, which I wish you could open up the image to look at it, but I'm looking at it on my other monitor right now um design wise it is pretty sick um it's one of those fusion digimon from digimon cross i think it's called in japanese or digimon fusion i never finished that season i got really fucking bored of it sorry to digimon fusion fans um but uh it seems over designed to the point where i don't really like it that much um i see a lot of just it just looks messy you know i think that's a problem with it a lot of overlap with the other digimon but I think that's how most fusion designs are. And I like some fusion designs. But this one just seems like there's too much going on. So I'm going to stick him in C tier. Which I think that's fair. Um, next we're going to get rid of these manga ones. We're going to go with Death Metal Greymon. Who I actually like a lot. Because of how different he looks. Uh, that's this guy right here if you've never seen him. I'm going to put a picture of him. Of them on this right side like I did for the Gururumon video. Go ahead and check that out if you didn't, by the way. Um, but for Death Metal Greymon... Is that what his name is? Or is it just Death Greymon? It's Death Metal Greymon. I really like the kind of mask-like face he has. Um, and I love the metal arm. It's way more, like, cybernetic. Like a... What, what's it called? Like a dual disc from Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. You see his little arm there? It's pretty similar to that. I love the giant claws, too. They're just so cool. I love things that are like, you crank it up to 10, but you match everything with an 11. That, that's what I really love about these designs. So I think I think this guy's a pretty solid pick for B tier as well. Um, not for like any particular reason, just because we need a baseline. And I think his design is just, it's more streamlined than what we have with this over kind of designed mess uh, Rampage Greymon there. Alright, moving on. We have Black War Greymon. Now, I know you guys... Uh, really loved my last video. Haha, <laughs> I don't know. But, um, I ranked a lot of these, um, virus versions of, uh, Greymon and Garumon, uh, pretty high, because I just love the, the color design on them. Black and yellow, just, it goes so hard, especially if you mix it with some silver, so I think Black War Greymon is gonna be, you know, there, I see a lot better designed things here. I think he's just gonna go in A. I don't want to fill up my S tier too much. I think I want to keep it a bit smaller than I did last time, and I think that's fine. Um, which, what the fuck is this one? We're gonna skip them for now. We're gonna go to Blitz Greymon, and um, you already, you guys already know how I feel about Blitz Greymon. He's fucking cool as hell. Swapping out the sword for the fucking guns as like a, a palette kind of or a reverse of fucking, um, what's it called, Metal Garurumon. That is the coolest. The coolest idea ever. And the crimson red with revolver arms. That, it, man, man, how do you make something that cool? I want what they were having. I want I want what's in their Wheaties. What's in their Cheerios, you know? But that's pretty fucking badass. It's also kind of scary that we went from C all the way up to S. But we're going to keep moving on. Um, next up, we got Chaos Black War Greymon. Um... He looks really fucking lame. Like, he's just this, but... This is just for comparison. Uh, he just looks... 
They're the same, aren't they? He has like shoulder pads. All right. Sorry, buddy. You go to F tier. You're not that different. You're kind of lame. You're copying what's better. Sorry, pal. Um, I don't know why there's two metal Greymon 2010s. Is that metal Greymon 2010? I genuinely... Oh, that's Decker Greymon. That's, uh, I don't know why there's two of them. But I love Decker Greymon. That's top of A. Bo both of them. Twins. Alright, next up. I believe this is Gaiomon X. Okay, wait, wait. I found the art for this guy. This is Black War Greymon X. I really hate him. Sorry, I'm really all over the place with this video, but uh, I just do not... I don't like it. He looks like... What's it called? Like a Bionicle, but like not in a good way because Bionicles are cool. I, I genuinely think he is... He has like those Wolverine claws, but they're like above his hand. Like gauntlets, kind of. I don't know. He looks too mechanical for me. I think he's going to go to D tier. Alright. Let's, um... Instead of doing the Gaiomons, let's scale back and let's start from actual Greymons. Because there's a lot. Well, you know, this whole list is... You know, I'm dumb. This whole list is Greymons. What am I saying? But let's go back to the, like, the OG Greymons first. So, normal Greymon. The helmet. The fucking... The blue stripes. It is, like, the quintessential evolution to Agumon. And it just feels so right that he just gets bigger and puts a hat on and i i fucking love that it is just so awesome so cute and i think it works so well for him so we're gonna go ahead and put him in s tier but i think he's before um blitz Greymon, just out of like my own design philosophy choices like i think having a sleek design the whole way through with lots of not moving parts essentially but parts that go together well makes it so much better i think to improve the greymon design you put some stripes on his head and you make him look fucking awesome but blitz greymon just stands above him just a little bit more for me um black greymon of course i love the black and blue that's also going to go in s tier i don't want to bloat it that much more so i think i should start capping out s tiers because i'm really generous with this shit because i just love every design ever uh, next up, where's another Greymon here? Who is this guy? Is this Greymon X? I don't know too much about X Digimon. Maybe I should do a big research video on that. I'm right, that is Greymon X. Um, he looks a little goofy to me. Uh, I do like the nose spike being its own kind of color instead of a mesh of the helmet. And I like the three spikes on the top of his head. He looks more Velociraptor-esque, which I think is cool. That's pretty sick. But I don't think he belongs in A or S tier. I think he sits right above um, Death Metal Greymon. Um, just out of like that Velociraptor design. Because Greymon's usually like, I guess a T-Rex, right? He's a T-Rex. But him being um, a Velociraptor kind of, it's pretty sick. Alright, next up we got Geo Greymon. And if you know me, you know I love Data Squad. Digimon Data Squad is so fucking badass. And Geo Greymon is like the perfect like I I don't want to say edgy, but like the perfect in quotes adult version of a Greymon in my head. He just gets more tone, a little bit less like kind of babyish in my head. And the red on the helmet, like I said, if you if you gave me a Greymon with blue stripes on its head, I would love it. But if you gave me a Greymon with red stripes and blue stripes on its body and head, I'm, I'm in love, bro. This shit is so fucking cool. So I think he's actually going to beat out both uh, original Greymons here. And sit pretty in front of uh, OG Greymon. Alright. Next up. We got... I'm trying to find one that I know the name of. We got another Greymon here. 2010 anime. I love his helmet. It is it is so badass looking. Um, he's like, um, what's that one Pokemon? Rampardos? He looks like him. And I love him. He is so cool. I also don't know why there's a little sprite version of him right here. But that, that's weird, right? Um, but I think he's a strong A tier. I don't think he beats out the normal designs. I, I just really love his design. You also see a, a special thing on his tail. It's like a cable almost. Which I think is pretty sick. And has like a little bayonet. Uh, this thing, I'm throwing that in F tier. I don't know what the fuck that is. Alright, um, next up. 
Uh, oh, that is this is Mega Decker Greymon one of these because I don't think there's art for it. I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep him there. Sorry, I've like I can't focus today. Um, my brain is melting or something. All right, let's do Emperor Greymon. Emperor Greymon is weird because like I, I don't even know. He's just like a knight kinda, and he's got. All that lightning, which is pretty sick. Um, I do like the design aspect of him being the dra like a dragon warrior, which is just pretty badass. Um, like overall, like if you said uh, that this is the dragon warrior, I'm immediately gonna be like, that is the coolest thing I've ever heard, because because that's just fucking awesome. Um, but yeah, Emperor Greymon's pretty sick. Um, apparently it possesses power over flame, which is said to have surpassed even the 10 legendary warriors. Um, pretty badass, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, it's Ka it's also known as Kaiser Greymon, maybe that's why I'm not realizing its name. But Emperor Greymon, I think, uh, top of B, actually. I really love the knight design with the kind of electric dragon swooping in from behind. Also, yeah, I'm, I don't know what my rulings are for this tier list. It could be they're cool. It could be like I have nostalgia. It could be like they're just, they're just like cool that we design. Um, I don't know. I, I have no like, what's it called? Uh, I can't think of the word, but I have no like list of what makes this list a list. You know, I'm just kind of going off vibes. That's me. I, I just go with the fucking flow. All right, next up, let's go ahead and look at our good old guy. Uh, ah. What the fuck is his name? Fucking uh, Rise Greymon. The man with the fucking gat on his fucking hand, bro. This guy got it. He stays strapped. You know that? This motherfucker is the funniest looking Digimon I've ever seen. He just has a fucking revolver for a hand. And he's got all this cool tech on his back. But I think, like, it's too much. The revolver hand? Cool as fuck. But I think there's so much going on that it kind of... It removes me from him being a Greymon. Like, you could have made his whole body, like, I don't know, like a white pearl kind of color. And give him a different bit of a head shape. And it could have been its own Digimon instead of a Greymon. I get what they were going for with um, this through line for this specific Agumon to uh, Greymon thing. But for me, I never liked this form. I thought it was just kind of weird. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and stick him in C tier. And I'm gonna stick them at the top of C tier because I'm not that mean, you know. Um, let's see, what do we got next here? Let's go with Skull Greymon, one of the OG Greymon designs and probably the coolest. Uh, I don't know if you guys have watched my top 10 Greymon video, but uh, Skull Greymon ranked, I think, pretty high as well. Um, one thing for me that was a selling factor is the really hidden design intricacies in him. He has a beating heart in the middle of this skeletal frame to show that he's not just all bones, you know? And the fucking nuke on his back is the coolest thing ever. Like, you can't tell me that's not sick. And it's like, it's all organic and weird looking. I, I think he actually goes at the top of S tier for me. And I think I need to, I'm realizing that I need to start putting more things in D and I need to be meaner. So we're going to start doing that now. But... I digress. Skull Greymon is still so badass, and I'm not going to change my mind on him being a, not being at the top of us. What am I saying? I'm, like, so off track. I don't even know. I just be talking, you know? Um, next. I really need a script, man. This shit is hard. Alright, next up we got... Let's see. You're scanning, scanning, scanning. Who do I want to rank next? You know what? Let's do the whole, uh, kind of line right here. These boys. Um... What is this motherfucker's name? Ah, Rise Greymon X. This little fucker right here. Oh, shit. Uh, Rise Greymon X, I think, is really sick. Uh, the kind of energy coming out of him and his sword being a gun is always fucking cool. And the symbol of courage being on his wings is pretty badass. This, I feel like, is a better evolution to... To, um... What's his name? R uh, not Rise... Uh, is wait, is that Rise Greymon? Am I going crazy? Wait, how is this a better Rise Greymon, man? What the hell? 
Rise Greymon X stomps normal Rise Greymon. That motherfucker going in fucking B tier. He don't beat out these guys for sure, but like, how does this design compare to that? That is not fair. They are not equal. No way. Alright, let's go ahead and move to one of my favorite, uh, what's it called, uh, Digimon here, uh, Shine Greymon. I fucking love Shine Greymon. Um, from the fucking wings having, like, blue energy swirling around them to the, the cool-ass tail with the very, uh, cathedral-like design. I, I really love him. It's a, such a interesting, uh, design choice for everything here. A very holy like Greymon, and I think um he belongs at the top of A actually. Actually, I'm gonna swap this around a bit. I think this works. Yeah, I'm gonna change these. Oh my gosh. Alright, next up, we're gonna go ahead and do Shine Greymon Burst Mode, who is the coolest fucking guy ever, dude. Flame weapons? Mwah. You you make me a motherfucker who can summon weapons out of flames, out of energy. I'm signed up. Motherfuckers like Vegito. That is the coolest shit ever. S fucking, what's it called? Spirit Sword? The uh, Kuwabara from Yu Yu Hakusho? Damn! Anyway, he going above his other variant. Because that's just badass. Um, I think this is Darkness Mode? Ruin Mode, right? I can't tell if it's Ruin Mode or not. I'm going to say it's Ruin Mode. Um... It's kind of the same, just more of like a purpley, darkish energy. But I don't think uh, I don't think I like it that much. I think I'm gonna put him in D. Um, for any reason, for for, bleh, for particular reasons, I just don't think it compares with anything above it. Because I do think its design is slightly different, and I don't really vibe with it. You know? Oh no, it's the same design. I guess I just don't like the purple fire. Uh, like I don't like it being like. Like, they saturate the whole thing, which is weird. They make them kind of black and white, which is dumb. I would just keep the reds and then pump up the purple to create a really cool contrast. I think that would have been way cooler. Um, yeah. Alright. I don't even know what the fuck this, this War Greymon is, but he's cool as hell, and he's going in B tier. Like, right here. I think that's like the... What's it called? Metabots? I think that's Metabots fucking... Uh, Greymon, War Greymon. He's cool as fuck looking though. He's like a mecha. I love that shit. Alright, let's do um this little guy, Greymon O. I don't like him. He's ugly. Um no other reason. It's just that I don't know. He just doesn't look that cool. There's so many fucking Greymon, man. I don't even think this is all of them, but this is what I'm gonna call my ranking. Don't know what this is. F tier. These guys don't like their designs. Sorry, buddy. You're just you're just a worse version of War Greymon to me. Uh, Gaiomon X. Is that Gaiomon? Yeah, it is Gaiomon. No, this is Gaiomon Fierce Blade Mode. Holy fuck, is he over designed? Um, I don't want to put him in F because like I could see it being like a Mad Samurai kind of thing with the design I'm looking at here, but I don't. I think he beats out the rest of D tier, but he doesn't go further than that. However, big however, normal guy Oman. The one of the coolest designs, Bushido Samurai, a guy with two crooked blades, just so badass. He goes right here, third spot in S tier. So fucking cool. Do I have a reason? No. Do I need a reason? No, because I know you all agree with me. Because Guy Oman is badass as fuck. Uh, next up is Grey Knightsmon. Don't know how this uh, is even a, a Greymon variant. I guess it's because there's a the Greymon. Is he the dog or the horse, or is he the man on the top? I have a lot of questions about this Digimon, and I don't like his design because I don't know if he has four legs. I think his legs are the Greymon, and the, or the the little dinosaur thing, and then his his wiener is is the head of the thing. I'm gonna put him end of D tier. Don't like him that much. Um. Next up, we got Metal Greymon 2010. I love this design. I really do. I love that it has cool fucking flying wings. 
and I don't think he beats out anything in B tier, but I think he's at the top of C tier, which I think is valid. Uh, up next, we got Metal Greymon Altarius mode. Altarius mode? Altarus? Altarus mode. I can't. I, I never knew how to say that shit. But I love him having guns. I know how y'all y'all be with me in this shit because I just be saying the same thing over and over again. But this is cool. This sits right at B tier. Um, then we got Metal Greymon with the Cyber Dramon thing. I think that's what it's called. Metal Greymon Cyber Dramon. Creative name. Don't like it. It might be the Metal Greymon we know, but he has like a weird flesh cannon from his chest. And I think that's disgusting. And I think he's going to go in the middle of D tier. Yeah. Oh, now we're getting some good shit. All right, let's, let's, uh, let's do some of the worst things first, and then we'll work our way up. All right, um, here we got Metal Greymon uh virus x that's a mouthful and then we got normal metal graymon x who i love metal graymon x is so fucking cool i love that design the fucking the energy wings uh but metal graymon virus x also has energy wings but they're like they're like fucked up you know like he's from hot topic or something but uh both of these guys uh i think top of c i don't think they uh beat that upper echelon a B tier or that lower echelon rather uh, I think they just kind of sit right here and I think that's fine let's go ahead and do war Greymon X I think that's what he is it is um I hate how blocky he is I think you want kind of sleek instead of like power loader armor for him and I think they missed the opportunity to um fix the design elements of war Greymon that are kind of lacking like war Greymon is a very fucking bulky ass silhouette i think slimming him up and then making him have more cooler design elements like um i don't know shield hands with big claws attached to the shields instead of the shields being separate there's a lot of things you could do but i think it doesn't even like if i was to design this i would design it like this guy right here the metabot version i don't know if that's true uh, if that's metabot correct me in the comments please but i think um i think he goes way at the end of b tier just because he's still cool I i'll give him that it's just he's not beating out these guys i i sound like a broken record but you know uh metal Greymon. i mean come on i don't even gotta explain i don't gotta explain they're just too cool Zeke Greymon, I love Zeke Greymon. He's going right over here. Uh, the golden clad gentleman. Too fucking cool, you know? Just that, I love that. Like, I know I said I hated the blocky design, but for him, it works. There's there's a difference in, like, posture. If you show me a cardboard box, right? I can imagine, like, a dog putting his legs through the bottom holes and through the front of the head. And that's what I think of when I see Zeke Greymon. War Greymon, however, is a man. That is a human. That is a dude, right? It doesn't work. All right, continuing on, we got Ancient Greymon. Um, I'm, 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 I'm gonna say it. My opinions have changed on Ancient Greymon. I don't like him that much anymore. I think he's kind of ugly. And um, I think it's mainly that I don't like that he's like a dragon. And I don't like that he has like bird wings. Why couldn't they make them like cool fire wing why well, maybe they are cool fire i really can't tell i just don't like it that much anymore and i think him going at the top of c works pretty well um ultimately we have two more guys left and i think you guys know where they're gonna be uh well at least one of them victory Greymon, however i think is the coolest thing making him uh like a a warrior warrior with no shield and just a giant fuck ass sword like dude they made this shit for me give me the guts berserk dragon slayer sword give me the fucking cloud strife sword whatever the fuck that shit's called this shit too fucking cool so he's going at the top of a and then i don't even need to explain myself everybody knows where war Greymon goes on a Greymon tier list he goes at the top the tippy tippy top he is the cream of the crop baby he is too badass, too cool, just the penultimate design, if you will, of this whole Greymon kind of species list. Um, I think that wraps it up. That's everybody. 
I'm sitting at about almost 30 minutes of recording. I'm going to have to cut this down a lot. Because I stutter. And I say ums and ahs. But it keeps me genuine and humble, you know? Uh, if you guys didn't agree with my list. If you agreed with my list. Anything, any takes in between. Saying that, oh, but this Greymon with the Sprite is my favorite. Um, Google the tier list. Plop it in the comments when you're done, dude. I'd love to know what you guys disagree or agree with me on. All I know is, if you ain't got War Greymon at the top of your list, you are not valid. All right. Go ahead. Drop a comment. Leave a like. Subscribe. The whole shebang. You know the deal. Love you guys very much. Thank you for watching all my new comeback videos. We're going to be trying to upload more often. Or at least I am. I started work recently. So it's a little bit hard for me to get videos out. So unscripted stuff like this. That doesn't take up a lot of time. Is definitely a little bit more better suited for my current situation but thank you guys for sticking around it means a lot that all the support and love you guys show me and i think that's gonna wrap it up i'll see you guys next time goons out